What's up, guys? 732 Review Crew here again. I'm Joe. I'm Mike. And I'm Mike. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm between two mics. <laughs> Woo! And we're back. Uh, we're back with episode 9, season 1 of Andor. Really excited to see maybe a pickup of pace a little. Maybe oh. a jailbreak, perhaps, the, using snow boots. I'm maybe. super stoked for this episode because there's a, there's a TikTok of the speech from episode 9 that um, uh, our boy spoilers. does. Spoilers. Ruined it. Spoilers. There's, there's always a speech. He, <laughs> he's always doing speeches. Um, but yeah, no, I'm super stoked because this is... Oh, Luthi? Luthi does oh, his, his little monologue. Okay. It's like, <laughs> Do not that inspires spoilers. me. So I'm pretty pretty psyched to see it with context. Okay, cool, cool. I'm, I'm hoping to see Brasos be my hero. Oh, yeah, he's gonna... He's gotta... Just I, go I really... I, I think so. He's just... Maybe he won't. Man, that would maybe, really bum me out. Maybe Bix punches the blonde lady in the face I mean, and just Bix busts out. Bix seems like she might have it in her. Bix is crazy. She, yeah, she, she low-key crazy. Yeah, she is the right amount of hot, so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited for this. This is definitely going to be a good episode, though. Excited to find out for them what happens. As a reminder, I've seen this, so I'm just going around for the journey with them. Um, can't wait to find out what happens in this episode with them. And we'll be starting this one pretty short, just to get right into it in three, two, one. One. Well, I will say, I have to put this out there. I, I'm proud of you. Like, you haven't let anything slip. I don't know if I can do this for, <laughs> for a full season of a show, just listening to us be dead wrong. <laughs> and just, like, just sit there and smile. That sets a tone right off the rip. I don't like wasting time. So does that. <laughs> I'll tell you everything I know to be true, and in doing so, perhaps convince you to cooperate without intervention. Failing that, we have Dr. Gorst. He's he looks like a Hi! <laughs> he looks <laughs> awful. Park attended a separatist meeting two years ago in Jonborough, where he met a woman who suggested that if he was serious about politics, he might like to act as liaison for Ferrix when he returned home. He was sent the fractal radio unit you used yesterday afternoon. Now, this unknown woman, who recruited him to the cause, yeah. seemed less interested in generating political activity yeah, on no, Ferrix than she was in using with, your planet's unique uh, commercial position to acquire stolen Imperial equipment. Mm. You're in my net, mix. Are you a fish or are you a thief? Hmm? Man, I want to watch her crash and burn, man. man. So bad. I don't think she will. I know, that's what makes me so angry. No recorded history of the Empire. Head butter, do it. She's a weasel. Damn. Dr. Gore seemed like a weasel. She a real ride or die, though. Give it to her. I don't think she, I mean, she is, but I don't think that's her main motivation. I think she just hates them. Yeah, fair. I don't like him. The restraints are nothing to be feared. Oh, God. We've taken the recordings and modified them slightly, layering, adjusting, and we've found a section of what we believe are primarily children. Has its own particular effect. She's not looking good. Wow. She does not. Yeah. Look good. Well, I mean, She's the, not the way up. you just explained it is, it's the death cries of an alien species. The children of an alien yes. species. That causes some sort of. The worst of the worst of the death cries. It's repeat listenings that cause the most damage. Are we ready? Oh That's man. Amazing. Yeah, I can't even imagine. What does it sound like? Wow. I like how I kind of like how the first what it sounds like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, what's everyone looking at? Something. What is happening? Seems like he's been busy. Mm, no boots. 
Man, I really do feel bad for her. That's how she gets radicalized. Yeah, man. Do you think I don't want to win? Am I working or not? One rack up, I was to lose. What are you waiting for? Is he losing it? Like me. Our vast responsibility is to the citizens who have sent us here. I assume the lights turning off or people just leaving. Yeah. See you sitting down. They're no longer recording now. I stand now. What do you think's happening? Something's wrong on two. They're going too fast. I can't read it. Everybody calm down. Something's really wrong on two. A long way, Kino. Yes, but you've got to stand up. He lets me do anything I want. <laughs> well, why don't you go try? <gasps> That's a family. Okay. Yep. The Empire doesn't rest one. The rebellion comes first. We take what's left. She's the one sent us in. Of course. That's how Paige is. You need to see her first and get cleaned up. You don't need to care. All they need to do is turn this floor on twice a day and keep their numbers rolling. Why bother listening to us? We are nothing to them. Now she's right. We're cheaper than droids and easier to replace. That's a pretty crazy way to think about it. He's right, though. Think they care what we say. <laughs> it's really funny because he literally can't go anywhere. <laughs> he, all, all he did was roll over <laughs> and turn his light off. He should have just kept being annoying. <laughs> That's a pretty dope statue, though. I kind of dig it. What, is the this icon? Yeah, the hologram. It's the hollow statue. Was withheld. You didn't question the mother? I decided to wait. Better now leaving her in place and standing back. She's too old and frail for anything serious. Mm. Mm. She's probably going to be the first one to shoot someone. <laughs> <laughs> She's also being watched by the rebellion. She's being watched by everybody. Yeah. <laughs> She's just a little old lady with a gun. <laughs> Have you heard? What? what happened to you in 2 five? You went to They don't know about it. They will find out. They're all gone. But who said those shifts? hundred men. I can't be right. He heard nothing. What did he say? They're all dead. Who's saying this? Yeah, it's text. They're all free. Kino, Hogwarts, Jim. We need to be careful. Unless they think we know the better. I'm starting to panic a little bit. He's like, I have 216 days Yeah, I, I, I for... <sighs> He just wants to go home. Just another day, another year. So let's keep our mouths shut, keep our heads down, until we know what's going on. Mm. Yeah, he's like, I'm not trying to die. I, I, well, he said, but he said it softly until we know what's going on. Meaning, like, if it's what's up, he's down. <laughs> he's about it. He's not trying to get fried for no reason. Something I should know. Dude, the time is terrible. This is so brief. One worries. I love Italian Grandma. Have you even said thank you to your uncle? <laughs> yeah, are you eating enough? It's called penis. Get in my private box. My private box. Mom, you can't go in my room. Don't look at my magazines. <laughs> I press a uniform. Oh, she's gaslighting him. Me as a thing. I move mountains to scrape you off the floor and put your back. New thing. I give up so much for you, Louie, and this is how you repay me. You don't say you love your mother. I don't even get a single hug. Weeks. What if I make your neglect drive me insane? Imagine that. She's gaslighting the hell out of him. Yeah, she is intense. You can easily ignore me. You know, they should scrap the whole headphones thing and just strap whoever they're trying to interrogate. <laughs> Touching brakes and now nothing. I've been promoted. I'm so proud of you. Did I tell you how proud of you? 
You're not nothing after all. <laughs> Have some more blue milk. Yeah, for the record, she's like, I prepare two meals a day. It's like, he's eating cereal. Put milk in a, in a vase. <laughs> oh, no. Are they going to use Grandpa as part of the distraction to get out? Because he's going crazy and going to die. At least you've not gone political, though. You know, all the interesting people are getting very tedious these days. No one ever calls me tedious. <laughs> this, is, this is some of my favorite writing. <laughs> that was beautiful. Everything was wrong. <laughs> so, yeah, but not political at all. Um, down bad. Yo, Bix is just having a bad time. Why they even show that? They were just like, yeah, she's still messed up. <laughs> <laughs> is he waiting beforehand and after to get. Well, he lied about the promotion. Yeah, so he could run into her. I wanted to thank you for the promotion. Oh, so you I did get promoted. Oh, well, my boss seems to think that you did. Have you been waiting out here? Yes. I'd never lie to you. <laughs> I'd never lie to you. I find you and it's not that easy. I tried following the conversation we had last month. It wasn't a conversation. You were brought in for questions. <laughs> <laughs> I'm stalking you. I know you work here. I come sometimes to see if I'll see you. I'm an ISP supervisor. Do you I thought I was done. After meeting you and just proving you understood. He's a, pal he's a paladin on his holy crusade, crusade right? That's what I'm saying! He's just being in your presence, I... That's his god. I mean, I, I understand where he's going with no, this, that's but he's coming he's off he's as stalker creepy. creepy. Oh, yeah, right yeah. I mean, he is stalker creepy. He's, he's not coming off, he I is. My deranged belief but she's just the Inquisitor so that has paladins beneath her. He's just a creeper. Yeah, he's... Uh, that's definitely not paladin behavior. There's evil paladins. What about, like, sad, sulky, cringy ones? That's, a, that's pretty much every paladin. Who target this? No, right. Go. Could they find him? Yeah, pilot. Seems like Homeboy's, like... Co-pilot. Huh? What pilot? I've been pilot. Since they found someone. I wish you'd called me sooner. Oh, he's fine. That would. What are they making? Mm. I don't know. Widgets? I kept thinking it was like 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 a base for like a droid or something. It might you know, like it looks lights. like it kinda looks like a cap for something. Oh really? Yeah, like you put like uh, brace bars and they connect to both ends. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> Are they keeping him alive? Like, like, trying to, like, delay him dying so they can escape? I don't know. <laughs> I think they're just looking out for their boy, because he's going to get, like, shocked if he doesn't. Oh, yeah, he's not. He's not hiding it now. It's not all dark. It's to save. He's had a massive stroke. Oh no. What are you doing? I can't help him. I can't help anyone. He'll pass peacefully, which is more than I can say for the rest of us. He's just, so he's really just the execution. He's right? euthanizing this dude. He's like a school mm -hmm. nurse, but he also has a gun. You heard me. <laughs> All his shoulders, you, all his legs. He just made it sound like no one gets out of there alive. Be real. Keep my head in line. What happened down on two? The mistake. A man who was just released on four ended up back on two the next day. Oh. Well, got out on the floor and then they killed them all. You need those other men there. They're just leaving. Oh, yeah, that's what they needed. He, now he's gonna be not an asshole. There's no, no one's getting out. He's like, I don't have 200 days left. I'm fucking stuck here. He goes, we're done. 
Oh yeah, look at that anger. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that was a great way to end that episode. That was awesome. Yeah. Now how they guard... Where's my monologue? <laughs> how they guards are on. When do I get my monologue? Well, TikTok lied to you, which has never happened before. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite quote from this episode is, how many guards are on each level? And then the final line is, never more than 12. He finally broke him down to say, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, yeah, no, the moment he realized he's not, he's getting, not getting out in 200 days, he's like, oh, it's crazy. <laughs> he's like, I'm getting out. I don't care. Scorched earth, baby. <laughs> so what they did was they released the guy, you know, and he ended up on a different floor, and somebody recognized him, probably saw him through the glass. So instead of transferring him to another planet, which is probably what they usually do, so that you can't end up... Or a different the... facility on the exactly. same planet. Yeah, he ended up in the same factory line, basically. And they were like, we got our purge so probably, the whole floor. They probably rioted, so they purged the floor so nobody could, mm -hmm. you know, know, which is what the, the power shock was. Well, I think what they, why they did that was they were trying to make sure the word didn't get out. And unfortunately, the med tech was the one who probably moved the bodies, so he probably was just like... But you're right. It was such a... Like Mike had pointed out earlier, when one person fell and died, the floor turned off for a mm -hmm. second. When they had to kill a hundred people, the whole place shut down. And there's only twelve guards on each floor, and each floor has uh, forty nine times seven. No, that's just the room. No, there's seven rooms per level. Each room has seven people at seven tables, so forty nine times seven. Yeah, so forty nine is three hundred fifty minus seven, three forty three. So, so right? maybe, so maybe about that. So there might be about three hundred and something inmates per level. Against twelve guards. 12 guards, and they're just but, and everyone who knows this is the the floor commanders, go the floor captains, whatever, and he's finally on board. Kino is finally, you know, he's finally seems like he's on board. So I think episode ten is the prison break, especially because yeah. they said you know <laughs> he said it wasn't going to be three episodes of prison. And guess what? We're going to the third episode of prison, baby. <laughs> maybe it's two and a half. Well, maybe I said that if we start the first two episodes, I said we're not going to be able to you know not stop watching if you. We watch the same Oh, episode. yeah, yeah. If you yeah. guys are going to see yeah, this, video, we got to go. We got to yeah. go. We got to watch it. Uh, um, how do you guys feel about Del being Mon Mothma's cousin? You know. That was a twist. Um, It lines up. I, I like it. I like that they keep tying stuff in together. Yeah. And you know, in that there's like no random character. But it kind of makes sense, right? Because other like, than Rosso. Because like, like Mon Mothma was, you know, on board with Luthier from the beginning, it seems like. Like, they were just aligned. So then, of course, the rebellious cousin is going to be like, hey, what are you doing with that dude? What's going on? And she's like, just go. Mm -hmm. And then they started their little friendship, and here we are. But it doesn't seem like Mon knew Vel was part of Aldani at no, all. No, no, no. Because she's she... like totally... I will say they seem to all be totally in the dark from whatever else but is that's, going on. That's at any given normal time. for like a rebellious group like this. That but way, when you get captured, you can't actually it divulge does it. Does show how much Luthen knows, though. I just want to put this. So if they catch him, like oh yeah, Luthen yeah. knows pretty yes, much. Which everything. is why he's <laughs> trying to kill Andor. <laughs> put this in perspective, though. Ma Mothma is freaking out over 40, 400,000 credits. They stole eighty million in the heist. Yeah. She four hundred thousand is like you know like a very small drop in the pot bucket compared to eighty million, and she's basically having to go to some like what seems like a, a criminal underlord. I thought like, she was like, just gonna ask Luthen for the money. Like, hey well, man, she like he has it. I don't think you want to deposit that money in your account, even though it seems like credits are fairly anonymous. I imagine you don't want to deposit that money yeah. in your account as a senator. Fair, 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 fair. <laughs> Plus, if you're a senator, you just get 400000 cash without, you know, she can at least be like, you know, I got it from this guy. So if she, if she well, I thought she was replacing it because they're trying to hide the fact yeah, that... Yeah, but if she replaces it randomly, how can she replace that? Whereas, well, if she replaces it with the money from the guy from her home planet, because they can at least be like, oh, you know, she might be getting some money from, like, a, a, a slumlord dude, whatever, whatever his name was. His name was literally, like, slum, but, like... Uh, you know, at least they can have a paper trail of where it's coming from. Whereas if she got it from Luthen, it links her. No, but, think... but it doesn't because clearly they can't track the money because no one said anything at any point in time about tracking the money. Well, no, they did. They said they're doing scans of accounts. That's why she's freaking out and talking to him. They're yes, for but they're just people. looking for like missing money and stuff like that. No, no, no. They're, they're not. They they're doing a scan to see if anyone dropped, like, deposited all the money from the robbery. Yeah. 
So when they so they can't trace the money though. No, it seems like credits aren't traceable, which is really weird. Well, it's not really weird because think about how many trillions of credits there are. I mean, we print billions of U.S. dollars, and they can track those pretty good. I mean, serial code. Yeah, you that's only because code. if you steal from the bank, they have new bills. They just made the bills. Mm-hmm. I mean, how well could they track out a hundred thousand dollars from nineteen fifty six? I don't know. So I'm going to assume they might be able to. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. Clearly they can't trace the credits. Yeah, but the problem is is that they're going through everyone's accounts and they're catching each individual flag that pops up while looking for all the money. So they see that she had the $400,000 withdrawal that disappeared off the ledger yes. in between, like, I guess, statements. So now they're going to be like, so where's the money? And she has to deposit it. Which is why she's going through the fuck, yeah, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah. he it needs to be like she I just needs that. to come up with it. Uh, aside from that, man, I hate the blonde ass be a woman so much. Torture. Scene. I'm actually she's just really, doing my my boo thing. Bix I'm in, like that. I'm like, enjoying her. Her character's really Bix good. Bix is broken. That's what I'm wondering. Like, Bix is she gonna, gonna recover do. or is she just like a, just, sh- a husk? Uh, trope would be Brasso just, breaks in, just slaps just her across the just, face. She just. Let's go. Which is disappointing, just because I feel like her character seemed like it had potential to be, like, a decent character, and instead they're just like, we're just gonna abuse this woman. Well, Tim died in That's her, her setup. She's, she, True. she's had, like, two big mental traumas in the series. Uh, yeah. Right. Well, three. No one Cassie Nandor is no definitely Cassie trauma. Nandor. <laughs> Unfortunately. Is that what you were thinking? Yeah. Wow, that was... I'm, I'm good. I'm uh, good. Good pairing, good pairing. Um, beyond that, I mean, what else had happened in this episode... Not much. The paladin dude's creepy. Paladin dude yeah, is stalking ugh, man. Or, um, ISB girl. ISB girl. <laughs> Fair boys, man. I mean, what what words are to say? I didn't. Thank not, you. You changed my life for the better. I'm just glad we got to see his mom again. That was pretty great. She's great. I mean, his mom is great. She's finally proud of him too. It all it took was him getting a promotion. She literally let like like a five minute straight verbal abuse of him, and then he's like, "I got a promotion, mom." She's like, "I'm so proud of you." Eat you. more cereal. You I love this. You have some like, more cereal. Yeah. Have another half bowl of whatever. This Captain is. Crunch Captain, berries with Captain blue milk. Yeah, that's yeah, so weird. <laughs> uh, beyond that, I mean, we have what seems to be the end of our three episode arc coming up right now. Oh um, yeah. What better Excited. way to do it than to just dive right into episode ten? Which we, we will be doing. So make sure you guys are watching, commenting, liking, and subscribing. And telling us your favorite parts of this series so far, as well as the episodes. And thank you for watching. We are the Review Crew. Yeah, thanks for the support. Thank guys. you, Appreciate everybody. It. And have a nice night. The boots. The boots. Right. Where's my fuck?